Okay, back in Vlog 4, I mentioned after my birthday, I will talk about my favorite movies and my favorite animes that I hold uh, dearly close to my heart. Yeah, this is Derek Yasha, and today I'm going to talk about why I love The Hangover, okay? Seriously, um, classic movie. What more could I say? I know the movie came out in 07 or 08 or whenever it was that it came out. Okay, but it's already a classic. You know, uh, the most memorable movie of 07 is The Hangover. Seriously, people talk about it a lot. Okay, it got a slot machine off of itself. Merchandise off of itself. You know, um, a Alan bobblehead. A stew bobblehead, and of course, a tiger bobblehead. Okay, what more could I say? The, mo the movie got a lot. Okay, a lot. Okay, it's a cult phenomenon, alright? And it's held as a classic by everyone, even though the, the movie wasn't out for that long. You know, what, it's only been out for like, what, a couple of years now? No, I know, but um, when you actually think about it, uh, the movie is not really that old, okay, it's not really that old, okay, but uh, mainly let me explain why I like it, um, first things first, I like that they're, they're going to Las Vegas, okay, just for uh, a one night, uh, fun night, before their, their friend gets married, of course, and mainly, um, I like the whole idea that uh, they wake up, and everything is messed up in the hotel room, okay? You got a tiger there. Uh, you got Stu's tooth missing. Um, I mean, shit just went down, okay? And uh, Doug, Doug got kidnapped, okay? So what else I like is that the movie is crazy and zany and weird. You know, it just gets weirder and weirder. Okay, and crazier and crazier. And, you know, it's so funny. It's so funny because how much shit they got into. Okay, seriously. Like, I mean... <laughs> I mean, the whole thing where they uh, meet Mr. Chow for the first time. Okay? And mainly he has a uh, uh, Doug. And, you know, he, he wants... Uh, you know, his, uh, his money or some crap like that, okay, or whatever it was, yeah, it's been a long time since I've ever seen the movie, sorry guys, but, uh, you know, anyways, I, I like that the, you know, Alan gets the kid, or the baby, or whatever, and, uh, you know, they get a police car, and, you know, they, they get, um, no, uh, I think uh, Stu um, got married to a hooker or something like that. And, uh, you know, thing, things like that. Just weird things. I think they uh, signed, uh, like, a thing for the, the police force to, to get electrocuted to train kids or something like that. That's really funny. I like that, okay? Uh, a plus for the movie. Mike Tyson, okay? Mike Tyson is the man. Let me tell you something. In this movie, Mike Tyson is the man. I wish that he was more in this movie. Okay? I wish he was a lot more. Like, more in the movie. If you know what I mean. He could he could have been in the whole movie, man. That's how much I, I loved Mike Tyson in this. Okay? Seriously, he's just funny. But um, what I did not like where he punches Alan in the face. Okay? Seriously, that just like uh, upset me a little bit because Alan is my favorite character because I, I can relate with Alan. You know, me and Alan is both weird, I know, okay? No, I know, and I like the whole uh, thing. It's just crazy, but I can't explain anymore because I don't want to give spoilers for the movie for people that never seen the movie before, but hell, a lot of people seen the movie. Okay, but, but for me, what I really like about it is uh, Alan, uh, Stu, and uh, Mr. Chow, and Mike Tyson himself. Okay, that, that's why I like. And I like the, the craziness. The, the, you know, it brings me a lot closer to this movie because 
hey, it's it's like you know one of the older movies, you know, like uh, Vacation or uh, The Great Outdoors or you know something like that, you know. But except that this is a hard R uh, rated. And, you know, you just have a lot of crazy, zany shit going on in the movie. No, I know, but why I really like the movie is because, you know, the movie is just just uh, amazing, man, and funny. It's amazing and funny, okay? And, you know, I regard this as one of the best 07 movies uh, ever made, seriously. I mean, what was around in 07? Nothing. Nothing good in 07, okay, what, it was just generic movies, or just, like, okay movies, or just, like, garbage movies, but this movie, I'm a lot closer to this movie, because this is, this is the best 07 movie, man, what more could I say, what more, I guess, uh, you know, the, the best comedy ever made in 07, you know? I guess I'll put it right next to um, Planes, Trains, and Automobiles, and Animal House, and, you know, things like that. I'll put it right next to those, okay? Hell, um, I, I guess even, uh, damn, I forgot what it was. Even, even, uh, Uncle Buck. Yeah, Uncle Buck. I'll put it, I'll put this right next to Uncle Buck, because... You know, Uncle Buck is crazy and zany too, man, but, I mean, this movie is a lot more crazy and zany, okay, just because of the crazy shit in it, okay, just because the crazy crap in it, okay, I mean, hell, man, you know, the cinematography really looked good in this movie, the visuals looked good in this movie, yeah, I like the way that the, the film is shot, okay, I like that this is, uh, you know, like, a comedy mixed in with a, a little bit of seri seriousness at the same time. Okay, I really lo love that a lot. And, you know, this is one of my favorite movies. And, you know, hell, I'm, I'm going to put it probably on the number five list. You know, probably next to Vacation and Trains, Planes, and Automobiles and Animal House and Uncle Buck. Seriously. So, yeah. You know, I'll, I'll put it on the top five list. You know. But, yeah, you know, it's it's a classic already, dude. Seriously, it's a classic already. I just, I just love it. I just, I just love it, man. Seriously. Um, I guess, I guess I like the one-liners in the movie. You know, I really like that, you know. And I guess what brings me a lot closer to the movie, I think I'm repeating myself over and over again, but that's all right. As this movie um, felt original to me, you know, it felt original to me. Maybe this was done in, di in a different movie, but to me, it, f it feels like a totally new idea to me. Hey, I think it was it was done in Dude, Where's My Car, okay? I think it was done in Dude, Where's My Car, but... You know, um, this is a lot better than Dude, Where's My Car? Because, you know, you, you have a lot more crazy, zany shit going on into the movie. Serious shit. I mean, don't get me wrong. Dude, Where's My Car Car is still a good movie, but I prefer this way more better than Dude, Where's My Car? I mean, come on, you know. I mean, where else are you going to get crazy, zany shit in a movie like this? Seriously. No, I know, but anyways, I guess this is why I love The Hangover. I'm out. Peace.